This video will cover the topic, solving a radical equation that simplifies to a linear equation, one radical, basic. For our first example, we will use the following radical equation, square root of y minus 10 equals 9. What would the first step be in solving this equation? Do we have to get rid of the square root? I'm glad you asked. You are correct in that our first step is to remove the square root. We square both sides of our equation, which results in y minus 10 equals 81. From there, we will isolate our y variable by adding 10 to both sides, which results in our final answer of y equals 91. What would happen if we had a problem such as square root x plus 16 minus 2 is equal to 6, where there is another number attached to the square root? In this case, we will first isolate the square root by adding 2 to both sides. This results in square root of x plus 16 equals 8. We now square both sides in order to remove the square root, which results in x plus 16 equals 64. We now isolate our x variable by subtracting 16 from both sides. This results in our final answer of x equals 48. I think I'm starting to understand the topic. We first have to make sure that the square root is isolated so that we can square both sides. Once we square both sides, we then isolate our variable in order to find our final answer. Great job! It seems like you understand how to solve a radical equation by simplifying it into a linear equation. 